Hey everybody, welcome into this new video. In this tutorial, let's see how we can use a Sana for our own project. Whether you are a part or say team member or you are a leader of this team or you are creating your own personal stuff, Sana is going to be helping us a lot to manage this project or even uh, our study field. So let's get started guys, I'm going to leave you a link down below in the description so you can get a great free trial mode of Asana premium plans because there are a few premium plans that you want to check it out. Of course Asana has a lot of things that it can offer totally for free but it's really worthy to check it out the premium plans if you want to check it out um, or if not, if not well be my guest but once again you have that 30 days free trial so it's up to you if you want to uh, redeem that or not. So once you synced into that, you want to go into the sign up section or just click into the link down below. You want to enter here your email and hit into sign up. So once this one has signed up uh, for us, what we want to do is to get started here by just verifying our account or continue with Google. If you want to continue with Google, it's going to be really, really easy. You just need to have your account already signed it in. So what's going to happen is going to be redirecting us right away into the application of Asana so we can start working light right away. Now what I want to do is to enter my full name and hit into continue. We have the what is the primary role. What I do want to focus is into the project manager or depending on the tool, the field that you want to work in, just select the option and hit into continue. Now, key what I want to do is to use the I'm the first from the team in Asana or my team is already using Asana. So I do love to use this option because I already know how this Asana works. So once you are in here into the project and process manager, you want to locate the I am not sure yet. And let's set up your first project. So this one is going to be helping us to create our first project. So you don't have to be like really confused or of where is where tool and where do I can do this or that and those. So what's something you and your team are currently working on? Let's say that we are working on a YouTube project. I'm going to hit into continue. What are a few tasks that you have to do for your YouTube project? So let's say that I'm creating a live streaming, a live stream uh, for December and then I want to schedule some post for Instagram and lastly I want to create a giveaway on Facebook. Hit into continue. Now how would you group this task into the sections or stages? So here is the to-do list the doing list and the done. So let's say that I w don't want to see to do list. Let's say that this is just like an idea of the pre-production. And then here into the doing, I'm going to leave it like that. Done. I think it's great for us. And what is the layout that works best for your projects? Here is like a list version. Here's the calendar, the timeline, and the board. In my case, I do love to choose the board because the board is going to be helping us just to drag our stuff like from one place into another one. And for me, the easier, the better. So I'm going to hit into continue. Here is my email address. So I want to input that once again. And I want to choose the teammate mem email, the teammate uh, emails. So I can add that into Azana. So I want to go into skip for now. If you want to download all this into your phone or into your own desktop, you can do that. In my case, I won't do this because I think I'm going to be just okay with the uh, Asana opened already into my own website. But I think it's really, really worthy to just take it out on your phone. But here I'm going to just skip that for now. Now we do have the trial of the 30 days left without having to even add a credit card. So it was really, really easy. We can hit into let's get started. And as you can see, remember that the YouTube project we just created now has been automatically, uh, let's say just really, really simple created. Here is my team members. I can create a new team. I can browse some teams if I want to join, join something else. And here into the goals, I can see the, the main goal that I have into my account. So let's say, for example, that I want to add a new goal or of reaching uh, 10,000 
followers. So my goal order, that will be me. The time period, you want to choose uh, at the end of the year, the privacy that will be only private. Let's say I just want to see this only for myself. So I don't want to add any members. The update method, I want to add this progress manually. And the measurement, measurement that will be in numbers. And the current value, let's say that I do have 1,090, 999 like this and the target value is 10,000 so I want to save the goal and as you can see here is the company goals so what I need to do if I want to progress here I want to select this option and let's say that I want to edit the progress settings if I want to do this automatically here is the progress shows so here I do have some sub goals and I have this project so the measurement of the project is once again into the numeric total the decimals that will be only for one and hit into save so once I connect a sub goal let's say for example reached one subscriber and once again here's the reaching of 10,000 subscribers the update method automatically go into save so if I go into once again into my project here uh, is the idea I can what, what I can do here into my progress I can just drag that as I am starting to work into my product that's what I do loved about Aizana it's really really easy to use I can customize it of course if I want to see something else for example I want to add an application of zoom so let's say that I want to use zoom and I want to add this to the project and I can connect that into zoom so automatically it's going to be sending me into grant permission to zoom so I can allow this to enter into my project management of Asana so really really easy use I can drag and drop all my application if this one is uh, really really use, uh, useful for me and here into your home if you are just getting started you can customize your home section your profile your, your own project download all the application for your mobile or desktop and have some browse integrations now browse integration is going to be helping us to connect into slack into gmail outlook outlook so zoom is a browse integration that is actually like helping us a lot so our team members they just need to avoid that part to go directly into zoom that us go into the sign in section download all the application sign it in once again and join the conversation so here into Asana, everything is going to be already opened, so we don't have to do absolutely anything. That's the reason we want to focus into the browse integrations. And of course, we can add YouTube, we can add a lot, a lot, a lot of integrations, depending on the project you do you, you have here into Asana. And lastly, what I just want to show you is the reporting section. So if you are starting with a team, you can track how does your team are working and how does your project it's uh, all the insight of what's happening here and how you can improve your work your measurement you can measure uh, actually any here anything here the data across teams project so i can go back into my reporting and here is my project and i have just one task left to do if i go back here is my task so as you can see guys it was really easy to use asana it was just a very basic tutorial how you can use all these tools and you want to check it out like all the overviews that you can change into your boats depending on how you are um, let's say more comfortable so hopefully this was a very useful video for you now don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more information more tips about Aizana and much more other project management applications that can be helping you to improve your work so thank you once again for watching this video guys I'll see you on the next one